Hello everybody, um, it's me, the Lego Squad, and uh, I'm back here for a contest entry, which you obviously saw that title. Um, anyways, this is for a Bricky Steamboat's 200 subscriber special. Um, I think now he has like 220, but, oh well. Um, anyways, um, so, I don't, at the time of me filming this, I don't know if I can enter more than one. And if I can, then I'm entering all these guys. There's like a, um, let me see. Three. There's 11 guys I'm entering. I hope I counted that right. Yeah, 11 guys I'm entering if I can enter more than one. Um, he didn't say, but if I can just enter one, then, uh,. I'll let him pick the one he thinks that, whichever one he thinks is the coolest looking one, or the best looking one, um, have that be the one that I entered, if you can just enter one. Um, uh, by the way, these are all purists, except for one of them, and that one isn't painted too much. Anyways, so I'm gonna, I have a bunch of figures here, um, most of these are just some of my purist DC figures, one of them is my only painted DC figure. And then I have uh, a couple Marvel, uh, three Marvel figures. Um, so I'll start over here with my custom Winter Soldier. I'm entering. Uh, it's kind of hard to decide which ones I wanted to enter. I was wanting to just enter five, but then I got a bunch of really cool ones. And then there's still a lot of figures here that I've made that I really thought about entering, like, some of my Watchmen people, uh, my Battle Damage Batman's right here, Nightwing, Hawkman, you know. Anyways, but, enough of those guys. Um, so here's my Winter Soldier figure, you know, out of, boy, um, pretty generic. I thought I was gonna get the official Winter Soldier, uh, figure, but I didn't have enough money for him. I thought it was over $50 instead of 75 <laughs> So, uh, I didn't get him. I still might get him off eBay or something. I don't know. Um, here's his, uh, silvery arm. It's chromish. It's kind of hard to tell on the camera. Um, oh well, though. So, um, pretty nice. Figure that on the back, he has, um, uh, no, two, that. It's like the back of the roll of the bullets, that right here. So, pretty basic figure, but he still looks really cool. Next one, um, I don't think I've shown you, oh, wait, no, I've shown him once in my October, um, minifigure collection. Oh, well, I haven't even uploaded that yet, I don't think. But I've filmed this guy, I don't think I've uploaded the video he's been in. But this is my, uh, dark blue variant for Spider-Man. I still have my regular Spider-Man, uh, right here. With the added pockets. And then my Iron Spider. 1602. Uh. And then Miles Morales is right over there. And then there's Scooby-Doo. Um, anyways. Uh, so this guy, he looks pretty cool. Um, I just thought I'd do this because I had some extra Spider-Man pieces laying around. And, uh, this could just be, like, a dark blue outfit for him. Or this could be somewhat of the Andrew Garfield version for him. Because I don't have a dark blue outfit. But this would probably be just an alternate costume because it would probably be a dark blue mask. Dark, I mean, dark red mask, not blue then this probably dark blue and stuff. So it's probably just like my inversion of Spider-Man. Even though this one kind of already was my inversion with the pockets. Anyways, um, so that's my second entry. My third one is one of my favorite DC figures. The Arkham Knight. He looks really cool looking, I think. There's the back of the printing. Um... He's got a lot of red detail right here. And then he does have red on his legs, but I thought these legs that I gave him looked cool enough. But I guess 
You can pretend the gold right here on them is red or something if you want to. I don't know. And then yeah, it just says like the uh, New 52 cowl with uh, this Batman head, the uh, New 52 cowl. Um, and then he yeah, has just two pistols. So that's a pretty cool figure. Next one is um, one of the figures I've done one of the mo some of the most work on as far as Pierce figures work goes. That is my well, the lighting just messed up. Okay, Let's put it down here. Uh, anyways, that is my Bane figure, and I do not know why the lighting's weird. My light is on. Um. Uh. I guess more light in here. Um. Okay, that kind of worked. Okay, that's better. Um, that is my Bane figure. Um, like I said, I think twice now. He has this armored thingy right here. Uh, I got that idea from the Moose figs. I don't even know if his Bane has... Uh, I think well, one of his Banes does, but his is like this other armored piece with this on it. And then here's this black sleeve, which is supposed to be kind of this sleeve that has the little dial on it with the pump thingy. Because he, ha he has something like that in the animated series. But it's not supposed to be connected to this thing or anything. It's just like some sleeve he pulls up. That has the vials and it, dials and everything. He has dark red gloves. Which look pretty nice. Um, he has a hood. Which looks really cool. Um, then he has these legs. Which a lot of people have given him. He did have uh, these legs. But I gave them to my Miles Morales, and he looks a lot cooler looking with them. Anyways, so, yeah, that's my Bane figure, which is my fourth entry. Uh, then we have one of my favorites. This is an old custom, but the Flash, with new legs and new arms. This looks a lot like the uh, Injustice Flash. Really cool looking. Um, there's a back of them. Uh, so that's really cool. Next is my modified Deathstroke. Um, I think I've shown you this before. I don't actually remember. I'm, I bet I have. Um, so this one, uh, my older, my other updated Deathstroke had like an orange hip, light blue legs, but I gave him some more black. So he has black legs with a little light blue hip. He has the same arms I gave him a while ago. Then he has a brick arms pistol. Uh, and then two gunmetal uh, katanas. So that's pretty cool. Deathstroke. Next is the painted figure. V for Vendetta. You guys have seen him a few times. Um, he looks really cool. Um, the only thing painted about him is the uh, head slash mask. Looks really nice. Um, there's the back of it. Uh, he also has this little cloth thingy right around there. Um, that's the only thing painted about him. And he has a couple daggers. Oh, um, and then for him over here, I have the mask, but that's not what I was showing you. Um, here's his hair that you can give him. Uh, I might do that real quick. Um. So here he is with the alternate hair. And it still fits on. Like so. Really cool, and as you can already tell, there's a little um, added mold thing at the bottom for like this chin piece because it kind of goes out a little bit or a bit further down. I don't know how to explain it. Um, there's kind of a side look at that. 
detail going down. Um, there's the back once again. So, one of my favorite figures for a movie I have not seen that I really want to. And then I've read parts of the comic. So I was at this bookstore, and I'm like, oh, whatever, I want to read it. Um, okay, back over here. Um, okay, we have four more figures in the entry. We have Ghost Rider. Which, that's my last Marvel figure I'm going to enter. Um, pretty generic. Let me take his chain off so you can see more detail of him. Um, white hands. Uh, he has these legs from Space Police. That fire thingy. By the way, this is the Johnny Blaze Ghost Rider. Anyways, um, next is one of my favorite figures, Harley Quinn. Looks really cool. She has, um, the arms from the Mad Scientist guy. Red hands. Um, these guys are just extended gloves. By the way, if you don't already know that. Um, a custom hammer. Or mallet. Little shoes. From, I forget who those legs came from. And then the awesome zombie cheerleader hair hey, that looks really nice on her. Um, next we have a few that I've modified a lot, and I don't think I've shown this to you either. Maybe I have, and I just don't remember. But this is my modified as Bat, or as real Batman. Or just Batman, the second one, or as real when he's Batman, whatever. Um, this looks really nice. He looks a lot better than what he did earlier. Which you can see in my older videos, he has a newer blue cowl. I don't even know. Where, oh, here is the older one. He had that. Oh, I didn't even know I had any of the new cows in blue, but I found out I did. I'm like, okay, I'm gonna give that to him. He has the same head he did. Wait, no, I think he had a black head. I don't even remember. Um, but it's just the uh, this head. I have a couple of those. Maybe I have three. I think I just have two though. Anyways, um, he has dark blue arms. I mean, not blue. Dark gray arms. And the legs, he has gray cufflings, gray hip, dark blue hands, uh, dark gray, uh, hip, I mean, light gray hip, and then this cape from one of the Spongebob sets when they're dressed up as superheroes. And it's, ha it has one hole, which is kind of a fun fact, I guess. Um, so there's that, and then there's this armor piece too, which you guys probably already noticed, but whatever. Um, yeah, so there's this real Batman, and then my last figure, I think I might have shown you, I don't remember. Uh, Anarchy, my updated figure to look more Arkham Origins-ish a bit. He's still kind of the classic look. But he has this bottle, because he has a bunch of those from Arkham Origins. He has some dark red on him. Uh, new body, new head, same hood, and then just look at the back. But, uh, yeah. And he has this little cloak thingy. It looks pretty nice on him, I think. So those are all the figures that I'm entering if I can enter more than one. If I can just enter one, then Bricky Steamboat can pick whichever one that is. Because Bricky Steamboat's pretty cool. Um, he has a lot of nice figures and a lot of cool videos. If you don't know who he is, go check him out. Um, uh, pretty cool. I'm just going to line all these guys up. Um, so, once again, my, the figures I'm entering are Ghost Rider, Harley Quinn, um, as real Batman, uh, Anarchy, V, Deathstroke, Flash, Bane, Arkham Knight, and Win Winter Soldier, and Dark Blue, Spider Man. So, um, yeah, that's basically it. Like I said, if I can enter all of them, I'm entering all of these. If I can only enter a few, like, if there's a limit, like, you can only enter five, 
uh, Bricky Simo can just pick his five favorite. And then if you can only enter one, then Bricky Simo can just pick his number one favorite that I've made of these. I don't know which mine is. Uh, these are really cool. Probably, probably be Harley Quinn as real Batman. Um, the Anarchy. Man, I like all of these. Uh, wow. This is kind of harder than I thought it'd be. Um, probably these. That's most of them. Um, so I want to take out Flash. Probably these are my five favorites that I'm entering. And I just noticed they're all DC, but oh well. Yeah, so, um, which one of these do you, not Bricky Steamboat people, um, do you think is your favorite? Um, do you guys think I have a chance of winning? And I probably will. Um, you guys, um, if I feel like it, I'll leave a link in the description to the, uh, contest entry. What you need to do is subscribe to him, like the video, comment, and share the video. Oh, and then, of course, enter any custom figure. Um, yeah, so check out his channel, guys. He has some really nice customs. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, favorite, subscribe, and share. And maybe I've already said that. I don't actually remember. Oh, well.